Hello and welcome to this quick overview of the golden threads of Boris Continuum with me, Ben Brownlee from Boris Effects. With over 250 different filters, it can seem overwhelming to try to master all of the Continuum package. The good news is that there are some common elements, golden threads that run through the entire series. So once you master these, you're on safer ground as you start to explore the rest of the effects. So join me as we take a quick look at the golden threads of Boris Continuum. The Effects Browser. The Effects Browser is a great way to save time and explore the possibilities of Continuum filters. Every effect comes with a number of presets and over 4,000 in total, designed to give you a useful starting point or to show what can be achieved with a little exploration. You can access these presets through the drop-down menu or you can actually see them in action through the FX browser. Here you can quickly preview them in action and find out which one suits you best. Hit apply and we're ready to customize the filter back in the host. There is even an FX browser filter, which allows you to preview every effect and all the presets in one. Great when you're searching for inspiration. Compare. Compare is a fantastic tool to have. It's an easy way to see a before and after without messing around with extra layers and masks. Simply choose how you want to compare the result, either to the original or even another layer, and you're ready. This is great if you want to see if you've pushed a restoration effect too far, or to remind you how far you've come from the original. Perfect for color effects. It's also a subtle way to show off and get an appreciative wow from clients with a click of a button. Pixel Chooser. The Pixel Chooser is a defining feature for Boris Continuum. It's a built-in way of defining and limiting where an effect is applied. We can do this either by using gradients and mask shapes to limit the effect, or by creating a mat with the luminance or color channels. These, of course, can be combined to make more refined selections. In addition to simple mask shapes, the Pixel Chooser has a version of Boris FX Mocha built directly into the plugin. We can use this to quickly track our shapes on moving footage or make more complex roto splines directly in your editing or compositing software. Mocha's tracking technology is also available outside of the Pixel Chooser in certain effects. The Pixel Chooser also has color keying capabilities, which are leveraged by default in filters such as Beauty Studio, but can be used wherever you find the Pixel Chooser. These shapes can also be saved as presets allowing you to quickly add on to an effect or add something different into the inverted result. It's very powerful. Beat Reactor. The Beat Reactor allows certain effects to drive multiple properties from audio. This can be to auto-animate filters such as transform, blurs or glows, or we can use it to drive particle systems to generate exciting audio visualizations. Simply choose your audio, select what property or properties you want to affect on the filter and decide which frequencies you're interested in. And the effect works instantly. You don't have to generate physical keyframes, which means you maintain complete control of the values without fiddling around with keyframes or expressions. Amazingly flexible with near limitless possibilities. The HUD. The HUD is our shortcut to defining and changing filter properties without leaving the comfort of the viewer. For example, when using Continuum's Primat Keyer, we can do most of the heavy lifting directly in the viewer. With other effects, such as color effects, glows, blurs, we determine the angle and magnitude of various parameters directly on the HUD, not a slider in sight. All of these features are designed to help you get the effect you want in the simplest way, in the fastest amount of time. Once you master the golden threads that run through Boris Continuum filters, you'll spend less time working and more time creating. Thanks again for joining me. If you found this video useful, then remember to hit the like button. For more ways to master Boris Continuum, subscribe to the Boris FX YouTube channel and check out our other tutorials. If we're missing something, then let me know in the comments below. My name's Ben Brownlee from Boris FX, and thanks for watching.